Hello everyone, this is Ninja Girl Sakura One here, back with my Kingdom Hearts Final Mix Let's Play. And yes, I know I accidentally said Kingdom Hearts 2 at the beginning of the last video. That was a really dumb slip of the tongue on my part, and I apologize. But yeah, anyway. Last time, we finished up the first visit to Hello Bastion. We continued making our way through the castle, and made an important discovery mainly about Kairi, she is in fact a princess of heart or a maiden with no darkness in their heart. And uh, we learn where her heart actually went and why she was comatose every time we've seen her. And why we've been seeing illusions of her also. Because when she vanished at the beginning of the game, her heart went inside of Sora. And uh, a now possessed Riku tried to get it from Sora. But, we defeated him, but in the end Sora sacrificed himself anyway to save Kairi's life. And then Kairi ended up saving him with her powers as a princess of heart, so Sora's back to normal now. Riku, however, he still needs our help. He needs rescuing, so we gotta get back to Halabastion and hopefully stop Ansem the Seeker of Darkness while we're at it. That's the goal, right? First step, though, to getting back there is we gotta talk to good old Sid. He will know what to do. As far as getting back, anyway. Hey, Sid. Sid, I need to go back to Hollow Bastion. I don't think I can let you do that, kid. The Heartless there are multiplying by the minute. Didi, your ship up. Then what can we do? Simple. Go around him instead of through. Install a new navigation gummy, and take a new route. A new gummy? From where? The secret waterway. When I came here nine years ago, I stored it there in case I ever needed it. Yeah, remember, most of you probably know this, but for anyone new to the series and unsure of how the timeline is, Birth by Sleep takes place ten years before this game, so that fits into that there. Ah, Sid's Jake! Look at his feet, seriously. <laughs> when he turns around, you'll see what I mean. Anyway, never thought a kid would be the one to use it. Well, we are. Well, thank you for the tip, Sid. To the secret waterway, then. I wonder. Oh, no. Oh, no! Sniper Wilds, run! 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 Sora, get down! Get down! Get down! Get down! Those things are one of the most annoying new Heartless in the entire game. My goodness. The Giga Shadows, the Pink Agaricus, they're kind of annoying, but those? The Sniper Wilds, they are worse. Just so you guys know their gimmick, basically you have to cast Stop on them and try not to let them see you. And there's always more than one, obviously. You have to continuously cast stop on them and try to not get killed. And not let others see you. Or stop them before they can call the others to you. Because, yeah, that is bad. They will kill you. Getting the ingredient from them for the Ultima weapon, which, yes, if you make it, you have to get ingredients from them. It's so annoying. It's hard enough in this game. It was hard enough in the original. The final mix made it even more difficult. Alright, wait, Trinity! Got it! What is it? Oh, Oracle okay! Hey, those are pretty good. And... Dalmatians, right? Yes, good. Alright. Now, for one of the sweetest scenes in the entire game. I love it so, so much. Alright. What a mysterious mural. It's almost hypnotizing. Yes, she's giving you a hint. I forgot we had to do this real quick first. But, uh... There it is. We got it. 
Very weird place to hide it, but whatever works. Now back to dear Kyrie. Let's go back and join the others. We should rest up. Okay. Ugh, I love this scene so much. A light at the end of the tunnel. Oh, your grandma's story, right? That's right. We were together. You know what's funny? I looked everywhere for you, but you were with me all along. Finally, we're together, Kyrie. Now, it's time to get Riku back. You think it'll ever be the same again between us? Riku's lost his... When I turned into a Heartless, you saved me, remember? I was lost in the darkness. I couldn't find my way. As I stumbled through the dark, I started forgetting things. My friends, who I was, the darkness almost swallowed me. But then, I heard a voice. Your voice. You brought me back. I didn't want to just forget about you, Sora. I couldn't. That's it! Our hearts are connected. And the light from our hearts broke through the darkness. I saw that light. I think that's what saved me. No matter how deep the darkness, a light shines within. I guess it's more than just a fairy tale. Well, let's go! You can't go. Why not? Because it's way too dangerous. Come on, Sora. We made it this far by sticking together. You can't go alone. Kyrie, even if we're apart, we're not alone anymore. Right? I can't help? You'd kind of be in my way. <laughs> okay. You win. Take this. It's my lucky charm. Be sure to bring it back to me. Don't worry. I will. Promise? Promise. Don't ever forget. Wherever you go, I'm always with you. Aww. They are just so cute! I love them together! Oh, final makes exclusive scene, by the way. Sora, Kyrie, I'm sorry. Is this the afterworld? Yeah, sadly these scenes are not voiced. I'm not ready. Not yet. Not until I see Sora and Kyrie one last time. Riku! Can you hear me? I'll be there soon! Who is that? I have the other Keyblade! The one that belongs to this world! I've been trying to get through to you, but the darkness in your heart kept me away. Who are you? What's happened to me? Your heart won the battle against darkness, but it was too late for your body. Uh-huh. That's why you're here. In this place of darkness, where hearts are gathered. So what do I do? The door of darkness will be open soon, but it's a door we can't enter. It has to be closed from both sides. Do this, you need two keys and two hearts. Maybe you're here for the same reason I am. Maybe it was fate. Fate, huh? You seem to know everything, don't you? Then tell me. Are Sora and Kairi okay? Don't you feel the echoes of their hearts? You already know the answer. Look inside your own heart. Okay. 
Yep, that was Mickey, of course, talking to Riku. And that scene right there does play into 0 0.2, because, you know, in the last trailer, it's very quick, but you do see a young Riku in the Realm of Darkness. So, and we also saw Mickey get the Kingdom Key D. So, that scene takes place right after he gets into 0 0.2. That's my guess. So, yeah. Pretty cool. What do you say, Kyrie? Don't ever forget, wherever you go, I'm always with you. Oh. They are just too cute! I love them together so much. I think they are my favorite animated couple besides Inuyasha and Kagome from the Inuyasha series, because their relationship in that series was developed really, really well, but Sora and Kairi, just as cute. Alright, well let's get back to Sid. Oh yes, and I need to show you guys uh, Oathkeeper as well, before we head out. Just to show you the stat- oh no! They're here, they're still here! Run! And they- no! 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 Well, you might get to see how easily they kill you! See? That's why they're annoying. I didn't expect them to still be there. I hate Sniper Wilds. They're one of the most annoying things. The good thing they're not in the other games. <laughs> Thank goodness. Can they not- Yes, they're gone. Well, it kinda worked out. They're still heartless, but they won't kill me as easily as those things. I think you're supposed to be a little bit higher of a level before trying to really take them on anyway, because you do need more magic. But anyway, I do need to show you Oathkeeper. There's the stats right there. It's, it's pretty good, but we're getting an even better Keyblade once we get back to Hollow Bastion, so sorry Kyrie, I won't be using it, I'm sorry, but don't worry. It'll be worth it in the end. You found it. Alright, I'll go fix up your ship. Alright, thanks, Sid. We'll be waiting. All set. You can get going anytime. Kid, I gotta say, I wish you didn't have to face all this danger. Ah, thanks. We'll be okay. Well, let's get a move on then. We gotta get back to Hollow Bastion. And I actually did beef up my gummy ship a little bit. I still want to show you guys a little trick though, if I can pull it off. Yes, we know, there's another warp hole. I know. There it is. Now, the trick I'm going to try and show you is you can actually skip a part of this gummy ship mission here. It requires dying, but only at a certain point. I think it's like the only glitch in this game at all. Because, surprisingly, all the Kingdom Hearts games are pretty solidly made. You won't find that many glitches and stuff. Unless you count the HD ring mixes. <laughs> Some of those crash your game. Yeah, I know. Yep, I have haste. Put that on. I don't know why I couldn't find it. And I have lasers. <laughs> Pretty cool, huh? I don't know why I couldn't find the haste in the menu. Um, last time I tried to go ahead and equip it. I don't know. I missed it, I guess. But let's go. Oh. I should have fired to get rid of those rocks beforehand. Anyway. Here we go! Alright. Yes! Destroy, please! So I can survive! Laser? So worth it. Oh dear! Fire the laser!
laser! Oh, goodness. Oh, goodness. Yeah. I gotta somehow survive. And I'm out of magic, so now I'm... I gotta use the regular laser. Darn it. That's okay. Ah! No, no, no! Shoot, I'm low on health with the gummy shit. That's not good. Okay. Try and get some health. Oh no! I missed all of that! Oh my. Goodness gracious! They really want to kill me, don't they? It's alright, I can make it. There we go, that's better. Yes, magic! Gotta be careful though. Don't want to waste it by accident. Whoop. Okay, it's right after here. I think you can die and you can actually skip the mission. So, pretty cool. I'll, s I'll see if I can pull it off here. Should be simple enough. <laughs> Just let myself die. That's pretty much it. I wouldn't do it if I didn't know that it can happen. I've seen it done. So. Now. That should do it. Am I correct? Yes, I am. There you go. That's the trick. You don't actually have to complete the mission. But it does require surviving for a little bit of time. But it worked! Ha! That is seriously the only glitch in this game that I know of. Again, unless you count the, uh, problems with the HD remixes. Yeah, for those who think that the PS4 versions 1 and 1 plus 2.5 don't need to exist, yes they do. Uh, 2.5 has more issues, but this game has 1.5 has a lot of crashing issues. Um, for example, I actually found this out recently. The final cutscene sometimes will crash the game. Or will crash before it loads, I should say. I knew beforehand that Simba can make the game crash. That I knew, which is why you won't see me using him. But, yeah. That's pretty bad. There's a lot of crashes in this game. 2.5, there's the loading problems with the dry forms, loading cutscenes. Sometimes after a cutscene will load and the regular gameplay goes to resume, the screen will pause for a split second, there's a crash with the first battle with Xemnas, there's a lot of problems. So the PS4 versions of these HD remixes, yes they need to happen, they need to exist, they are going to exist for a reason. All we can do is hope that Square does fix the issues, which they probably will, I'm sure they've heard enough about them, they know to fix it, so, but yeah. If you want to wait to buy it until you know that these problems are fixed, which is probably what I'm going to do, definitely do that. But don't write them off as just a cash grab. They are going to exist for a reason. So yeah. Anyway, tangent over. Where's Belle? Still in the castle. Against her will? No, I think she stayed for a reason. The other princesses are inside as well. I wonder why? Let's go ask them. You may need my strength. I'll go with you. Alright, thanks, beast. Actually, I'm gonna stick with the original group, though. Alright. Although, do you have anything, beast? Just... You do. Good. Just figured I'd check for the, uh, heck of it. Sometimes uh, the game will restore items, sometimes I guess, to uh, the other characters, but I think... Well, let me get to the library, then I'll stop. That's fair enough. 
was gonna stop there, but let's get to the library, because, yeah, it's, the sad part about this is, and it's kind of annoying, is we're gonna have to climb the whole castle again, so, yeah. That kind of stinks, but I don't think the game resets, like, the platforms that you gotta lower down, the switches you activate. I don't think it changes that, so that's good. Trinity! Let's activate that. I think this is a gummy item, probably. But hey, I'm here, may as well get it. It is, Sonic G. Well, still. Whoop. Jump. Alright. Actually, I need to go to the library anyway, because I want to show you guys what you get. <laughs> a certain keyblade that's extremely handy. You'll see. It would have been silly to stop back at the Rising Falls then. Alright. There we are, library. I'm definitely gonna have to take some time out and grind soon, though. Because we are getting very, very close to end game, And, oh, it's going to be so cool. It's definitely one of the most epic parts of the game, besides the first visit here. I find the first visit here to be so awesome and epic, filled with awesome story, great plot points, and I love it. But anyway, look who's here. Hey, Belle. Glad you're safe. Speaking of which, some of the new products and stuff for the live-action remake of Beauty and the Beast? Ugh. I really hate that they're doing it, but they are. But hey, Emma Watson's playing Belle. But yeah, some of the products, like the dolls and stuff, have started to come out, and they actually look pretty cool. I would only get Belle, though, to make it into Hermione. Just, yeah. My own idea is somebody who does like toys, despite being grown up. <laughs> anyway, you've come to seal the keyhole, right? Please be careful. The darkness is raging deep inside. We've been holding it back, but we can't hold out much longer. We'll take care of it. Yeah, don't worry, Belle. We got you back. Just hang on until we can get all of this taken care of, okay? But don't leave the room yet. Talk to her. This is for you. Use it to face the darkness as Beast has. Divine Rose Keychain, you want this? Why? Whoop. Gotta wait for her to stop. Okay. Why do you want this, as I was saying? Look at the strength stat. Magic goes down by one point, but hey. Your strength. Look at it. It's... That's pretty dang good. <laughs> now. Oblivion used to actually be stronger than Divine Rose in the PS2 uh, original version of Kingdom Hearts 1. But, that has been changed for Final Mix. I think it's changed in the PS2 version of Kingdom Hearts 1 Final Mix as well. It's not a 1.5 thing, but either way, Divine Rose, a lot stronger. Which is why I didn't put on Oath Keeper. So, Divine Rose, equip it. You want it. It's worth it. <laughs> Trust me on that. Okay, but now that that's done, I'm going to stop this part here, and next time we are going to have to make our way back up the castle and take on the final keyhole and finish this up. And then, end game. So look forward to that. But, until we get back up there, back to the final keyhole, and settle this here, I will see you guys next time.